January 8th, 2016. I'm not sure my first video that I did recorded. So I'm going to shoot it again. This is a handheld LED work light. I got it from uh, Northern Hydraulic. This is a little toolbox I got at Harbor Freight. And I've mounted it to the floor of the trailer and inside are the switches for the lights that run off the battery. There's the winch. There's the strobe. Those are the work lights. Got one mounted up here on the inside. The bolt is not fastened. There's a bracket on the outside so I can move it to the outside if I need to get light over here. The bracket on the other side got hit with a piece of equipment so it's gone. Uh, so the light is just sitting there. I noticed when I came over this morning this marker light has a habit of bouncing off. Hopefully it's somewhere near the shop. Here's this light. I do have, I did put in a SEA, SAE, SAE, two wire plug on these. There are extension cables in my toolbox so that if I need to work on something farther away, the back of the trailer or whatnot, I can uh, add that extra wire and run the light out where I need it. it you know, this is pretty good, but somehow things don't always seem to stay. They get moved from vehicle to vehicle or whatever. So we do what we can. Shut those off. Now I'm going to load the lawnmower. bring it over to storage. We'll put the 425 in the garage where it's warm. It followed the plug a couple weeks ago and seemed to run fine when I switched the plug ran fine this morning when I loaded it up started it up and by the time I got across town it was coughing and banging and missing again and it certainly didn't blow snow like it should have so it wasn't running right uh, maybe I have to get the mechanic over here and look at that today but 